Happy New Year. I know this is the first week of the year. I must come out to join you double-double, eh? Yeah? You may be seated. Thank you. The reason why I'm here is to bring out the ABC message for this year. And I'm going to give you the A right now. The reason why I'm coming out to give this, because event has begun to take over. Okay, I, some of the message we, I, I received at the Monte on the 27th, 28th, has happened. But uh, I was waiting for the B, C, so that I can have them comprehensively. And uh, you know, this thing has to do with the integrity. When T.B. Joshua say A, and it's not like that, next year they'll say a ah, prophet of doom. So when you want to say something on behalf of God, you must make sure it's God that sent you. So they will read the A for you now. And uh, you will be waiting for B maybe next week, okay? I had to release this prophecy because event has begun to take over some. And a good example is this, which was given since 28 December. We just compile it. An incident will happen to the nation, comma, Iran, that will cause panic throughout the world. We are praying to know the mind of God concerning this. That was on 27 December. But see what happened three days ago. You remember last year what God said to us, that this year is very, very, very fearful. That was the, the last year. And uh, it was just a summary, was, I was telling you people. But I was not giving you people the detail. But you are able to see that indeed, the last year was very, very well. And uh, that last year is still, it will end around March by God Constable. So the, let them read for you. I'm so concerned about what is going to happen this year. So much concerned than anything. Okay, if something wants to catch you, it should not catch you unprepared. But I know you don't mind. You don't mind, but I am very, very concerned. I'm very, very concerned. See what I'm talking about? An incident will happen to the nation Iran that will cause panic throughout the world. So, okay, I will leave evangelists. You take over. Thank you. Happy New Year. Good morning, church. Our prayer warriors are on their knees praying to make sure the changeable ones are changed. Prophecy is a guide to life. This is the word of God. Happy New Year. These prophecies were released on 28 December 2019, but made available on 5th January 2020. I will read just a few, and the rest, you will find them on our official social media accounts. Prophecy for 2020, Prophet T.B. Joshua. Prophecy for the world. One, this year will be a year of humility. This year, the Lord will humble us with our challenges. Challenges can be affliction, arrogance, pride, wickedness, or bad habits. To humble us with these is for these things to destroy us or expose us. Let us move closer to God. Are we clear with the first prophecy? Two, agriculture will help the economy because the economy will have a backlash. People should invest in agriculture. Let us farm to help the economy. 
three, there will be a common medicine that will cause people to be high to die, to commit suicide, to think of what can lead to death. The government of each nation should watch out and put a check on pharmaceutical drugs that come to the country. Are we clear with the third prophecy? Four, America should invest more in agriculture because their economy will be affected. The economy they see today will be affected. So they should invest in agriculture and encourage their farmers. Also, approach to the security issue will affect the candidates and swing voters in the next election. It will be tough in the election. They should pray against a recount. It may be too tight. Remember that I am reading just a few of the prophecies. The rest, you will find them on our social media accounts. Five, let us pray for the Nigerian government to be able to finish this year without an interlude that will cause a situation of four and against. Join me in praying for my nation. Is it clear? Six, Vice President, it is not yet over. Expect much more pressure. The pressure will be so much. I pray you will be able to stand the pressure. We join you in prayer. Is it clear? Seven, many sicknesses and diseases that leaders have been treating privately will surface this year. They will become bedridden and many will not make it. Eight, Russia should pray for their leader to avert his being on the sick bed. Something will surface. There is a ladder to go up if this is averted. Are we clear? Nine, the reason the man of God, Prophet T.B. Joshua, is releasing this is because there is a case that happened in Iran three days ago, which is part of the prophecies that have been released on the 28th of December, 2019, if I may read that prophecy. An incident will happen to the nation Iran that will cause panic throughout the world. We are praying to know the mind of God concerning this. Don't forget, these prophecies were released on the 28th of December, 2019, but are made available for you today, 5th January, 2020, because some of the prophecies are coming to pass. Therefore, there is a need to release part one so we can wait for part two, which will be made available for you on our official social media accounts. 10, work of God. People will be getting tired this year because the work of God is not by power and might. Because of so many challenges, tribulations and burdens, they will not be able to bear. Are we clear with the 10th prophecy? 11, United Kingdom. There will be agitation from a section that wants to leave. That will become an issue. Also, pray for the Queen and the Duke of Edinburgh against going in and out of the hospital. Pray for God to give them revival. Pray for unity and understanding among the royal family because of what I am seeing. Brexit needs more time to stand on its feet with cooperation of the EU leaders. If not, there will be economic repercussions and the cost of things will become unbearable. With time and preparation, all will be well. Note, part two will be released after thorough confirmation from God. This is just part one. Part two will be released after thorough confirmation from God. The rest will be made available on our official social media accounts. Thank you and God bless you.